How you doing, everybody? Bob Ryan here again. I always want to thank Marty for having me. Marty Schwartz. I'm at my house here. You know, I've been talking about these G runs, a series of G runs we're doing. And some of these open G runs can be rather bluesy, almost Jimmy Vaughnish, you know, a Texas blues thing where the one we're doing today is quite hip. You might have heard me do it. Uh, it's this. Uh, get up to speed. Let me slow it down for you, okay? So it's a little half step slide on your B string with your ring finger from the second to third fret. And then we're going to add in our first fret high E string like this. See that? Okay. So you're going to hold it both of it, all right? Which is up here. It's the same thing in your extended blues G, right? Okay, so we've done this little half step slide on the B string. I'm barring both strings with my index finger right here, folks. Okay, kids. So I'm doing the slide. And then I pull off on the B string. And my index finger is waiting on the first fret here, barred, okay? So my next move is this pull off. And I'm pulling off from the third fret to the first fret there, okay? So I'm going, I've pulled off on the B string, then I hit the, then I hit the third fret G string, pull off, pull off the B string, then pull off the G string, oh, to open. Then I hit that D string, third fret. That open G is that last note. Open G. Slow way down. Okay. That's cool, huh? Release to open. Okay. So what we've done is now we're gonna go down to our D string. Okay. Second fret and open. Okay. And then G string open. Back to that D string, second fret. Now A string, first and second fret to finish up our lick. And then last cool note is that low G note on the opening on the G on the low E string. Up to speed, then I'll do it slow for you. Good luck. Mm -hmm. 